10,000 elements. It's over 9,000. It really is. This video is all about taking a deep dive into one of the largest packs ever developed for video creators. And this pack is called Cine Punch, and this is a pack I've been using for several years, and I want to showcase a great pack of elements on this channel. Hey, what's going on, internet? This is Josh Noel from Sunduck Film. Welcome to our channel. If you're new here, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Hope everyone is doing excellent today. Cine Punch is a pack of video elements like sound effects, particles, fire, lens flares, transitions, LUTs, and just so much more that I can't remember everything that's in this pack. So in this video, I wanna show you a small fraction of the elements in this pack because you know I can't go through everything, 10,000 elements, but you'll get an idea of how this pack works, how it can save you time, and of course, it'll show you how to enhance your work, and this works for pretty much any editing application. So use After Effects, Premiere Pro, Final Cut, DaVinci Resolve, blah, 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 all of it, pretty much this pack is good for you to help you enhance your work. And at any time during this video, you wanna take a look at Sending Punch and all the elements, the link will be below. All right, so we'll be taking a look at Cine Punch right here inside of After Effects. And what Cine Punch allows you to do is to help you just really enhance your work or even do completed projects. But for example, we have all these different elements here on Cine Punch on the page. You can see there's just so much to work with. But how this simply works is that everything is third party assets. For example, I have, say, Cine Punch Dust assets in here, and I can go through different folders and find different you know elements to overlay on top of so i already have this particle layer here and i can import it into my composition and i can just you know scale this down because this is a 4k asset which is really nice and i'll come here to the blend mode and set this to screen so now we're gonna have some particles flying through our scene right here and that adds a nice layer of depth to our project and we can add say a lens flare and there's over 200 lens flares uh, that work from it here in Sydney punch so you can kind of pick and download what works best for you so now we have a lens flare applied to the scene, which may work or may not work depending on what you're doing, but you have lens flares to in integrate into your motion graphics and video projects. And we also have this library of sound effects. I only downloaded a small portion, but there's a lot to choose from in here and you can just apply a quick sound effect, you know, mix to it. So, it's, you know, you have complete mixes for your motion graphics or for your VFX or whatever edit you're working on. And that can help make a big difference inside your work. So with the sound effects, this is what it can sound like. All right, another pack that you might like in here called Glam, and they're simply like these like bokeh-based type particles, kind of good for celebration type videos, I guess, and you can just bring one in here in After Effects and you can just see how they look. And as you see, like another pack that you may have never thought about having can help bring some value to your work as well. Another specific pack you might like in here is called uh, Leak Punch, which are simply just light leaks um, like this. You know, you can overlay it on top of your video footage or motion graphics. So I'll bring this into my composition and click on screen. And it's a nice way to open up your scene if you're working on After Effects projects or even you know, a great transition into an overall uh, video. And you take all these elements and obviously composite it into live action footage. So we have particles, a lens flare, and even the light leak here. Without these elements, you, know, you, you just have a very you know, standard shot. So all these elements can come together. And you see the lens flare with the particles helps make a difference in the scene. Um, and then you can start off the scene with a light leak so these are just a fraction of the elements inside of this pack that you can use, but you can see how easy it is to use these elements, whether using After Effects or even Premiere Pro. And one thing we didn't take a look at are the transitions for Premiere Pro. It's pretty simple. You can just drag and drop your transitions into your project um, and it works really well. And you have those transitions available for your project. So you pretty much have all the elements you need to help spice up your videos. And right here, you can see that you have a full pack of 700 LUTs, which are simply just think of them as color correction presets. Um, for your video footage. So if you do want to save yourself some time, you have a full pack of 700 to work through for your video footage. And you see these look pretty cool. And there's 2400 sound effects in this pack and everything is organized completely exactly how you would need it. So all the different categories of sound effects for you know whatever mood sound effects you may need for your projects. So that is my review on Cine Punch. And like I said, I've been using this pack for a couple of years and I'm always looking to showcase stuff that I use on the channel right here. So that is Cine Punch. So if you want to take a look at it, the link will be below. But as always, thank you so much for watching this video. If you're new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button because we post multiple post-production tutorials every single week right here on the channel. You can also hit me up on my social media networks. Those links are below. And always be creating.